hi guys welcome to our channel uh to our subscribers we just want to say thank you for your continued support thank you for watching commenting liking and sharing our material if you are new here we just want to say welcome and uh, please remember to subscribe and also to click on the notification bell so that you may be notified whenever we have a new upload other than that welcome stay tuned and enjoy our news update Good day. Earlier this week, there was an accident in Johannesburg on the Golden Highway. In that accident, several people have lost their lives. Among uh, those people, there were also three siblings who were traveling together, going to school, and they also couldn't make it. Let's look into that story. Three siblings lost their lives in a car accident on Wednesday on their way to school. Yesterday, their mom, Udile, who is 34 years old, visited the spot where her kids took their last breath. And she couldn't hold back her tears when she saw the accident scene. Hundreds of mourners gathered at the accident scene uh, on the Golden Highway yesterday and they held a memorial service for all the people that lost their lives there. The siblings were amongst uh, the 12 people who died when, they t when the taxi collided with an Avanza. Dignitaries who attended uh, the service included Johannesburg Metropolis uh, spokesperson, Chief Superintendent uh, Wayne Mayner. The spokesperson of the families involved, Nul Med, said, We applaud the cops and emergency services for the work they have done. We don't blame anyone. We urge motorists uh, to be careful on the road. Chief Superintendent Minar sent condolences to the families who lost their loved ones. He said uh, he received a call in the morning informing him that uh, five people have lost their lives at the scene. He went further to say, five minutes later, I received another call informing me that the number has risen to 10. When our men were done at the scene, they went to Barra Hospital and I was told that the number is now 12. Johannesburg Emergency uh, Medical Services spokesperson uh, Nonge Mulwele said, I can't express how I feel. The nation is mourning for those who have lost their, their lives. Uh, both the drivers of the vehicles also lost their lives. We send our heartfelt condolences to the families involved. This is a very um, disturbing situation. May the good Lord continue to strengthen their souls. Thank you so, so much for watching. We'll see you again in the next video. Thank you. Bye.